Hey, I'm Brandon Ryan from Roland, and today I'm here to talk to you about the ERA modular effects. Particularly, we're going to talk about the Demora, which is a very high-resolution delay. Uh, it has a range of 20 microseconds all the way to 10 seconds, so with a really, really smooth response. Uh, really amazing sounding delay. I'll give you a uh, a listen to it in a second, but just quickly I want to talk about kind of the unique characteristics of the Demora and the other era modular effects. First of all, they have a very high resolution DSP inside them, 32-bit uh, 96K resolution. Uh, they can be used as 24-bit 96K audio interfaces, which is particularly useful in a Eurorack scenario. Uh, they do interface really wonderfully with uh, modular and Eurorack systems as they have uh, a lot of inputs in the front, so you can modulate the parameters uh, via CV gate. Uh, and, of course, uh, they can screw right into a Eurorack system. They can power off of Eurorack power. However, they can also be used on a tabletop uh, with standard 9-volt power, so they can be useful for not only uh, synthesizer and modular enthusiasts, but also guitarists, DJs, keyboard players, or anyone who's really uh, interested in getting unique and kind of adventurous sounds through effects. So the Demora, as I mentioned, very, very high-resolution delay. Uh, you can get a really, really short delay out of it to get some kind of crazy kind of phasing, pingy type sounds, or it can go completely high feedback, 10-second uh, delay to get huge washes, and also some very dramatic effects, as you'll hear. So first, let's take a listen to it, um, just how it sounds on its own. So as you can see, it can do some really cool short delay sounds or some really, really dramatic uh, delay sounds, to say the least. Um, but like the other ERA effects, you can use the free ERA customizer application to completely reconfigure the internals of this effect. It basically has a little mini modular inside of the Demora. Uh, you can access this via Mac or PC over USB uh, or on Android tablets, iOS phones, and iOS tablets just using standard audio input. So I'm going to go ahead and just take an audio cable connected right to the audio output of an iPad, plug it into the remote input in the front here, and uh, in the uh, customizer, I can go ahead and say, all right, well, what module do we want to work with? We want to work with Demora. And then I can change anything I want about it. So I have 15, currently 15 sub-modules. There will be more. Uh, and I can say, well, let's maybe put a 6 dB filter here. And I go ahead and make my connections just by dragging and dropping to any available input. And I can continue to add modules. Uh, you can also uh, load presets, share presets with people, save presets. And I can turn Demora basically basically into like a really cool chorus effect. So here I have an amp module connected to an LFO that's going to basically turn Demora into a chorus. And let's go ahead and take a listen to it. So that's just one of the things you can do with it. You can also turn it into a flanger uh, or create any kind of wild effects that are really uh, only limited by your imagination with these things. So again, this is one of the era modular effects. They can be used tabletop. They can be used in Eurorack. Uh, you can easily plug into it and modulate any of the parameters from CV gate. Uh, very, very high resolution sound, made in Japan, high build quality, and great feel. If you have any more questions about uh, this era effect or any others, contact your Sweetwater sales engineer. I'm Brandon Ryan from Roland. Thank you very much.